Hi guys, so I'm at Costco. This is one kilo of spinach for essentially $12. Um, oh, and I am filming from Sydney. So this is one of the Costco's in Sydney, that is. And that's $4.99 for like the green beans. And I think this is lettuce leaves from what I can see. I thought I'll just film this to give you guys a quick view of what they sell and the price range especially for those who don't have a membership and are maybe thinking of getting one so hopefully you guys find this helpful I know a lot of people get these baby cucumbers there um, they have capsicums as you guys can see the baby cucumbers are $10 for a whole box which has a kilo in there and these green beans, um, I think they're 500 grams, I think. If I'm going too fast, guys, just pause the video so you can have a closer look at things. Because um, when I was filming, there obviously there's people around and I don't want to take too much time to film and get in people's way. So they have cauliflower and broccoli cut fresh as well. And I believe they have this in the freezer section as well so now we're hitting the seafood aisles or the fridge section two kilos of mussels fifteen dollars they've got oysters they've got prawns um scallops all sorts of fish and i know some of you guys from different states are probably wondering if the pricing for items in the Sydney Costco are different and I think it does vary because I know grocery prices at Coles and Woolies varies depending on what area you are in as well. Um, as you guys can see here Costco sells fillets of fish and they also sell whole fish for those who want to purchase like the whole fish to steam and whatnot. There's silver perch, there's barramundi, there's all sorts of goodies salmon as you guys can see here salmon's a little bit more expensive i think here compared to coles and woolies in my local area at least but it's a little bit more tasty at costco in my opinion the meats you guys can see let me just pick that up so you guys can see that's 32 dollars for that little it. on their label if you pause the video you can see how much they charge per kilo i thought i did a pretty good job at filming but some of the prices are a little bit difficult to see so i do apologize for that they sell meat packets as well as you guys can see you've got the roast you've got the pork chops and all these goodies they've got ribs pork belly the pork belly is actually a a dollar more expensive at Costco compared to my local Woolies but I don't know maybe it tastes better I'm not too sure I haven't tried pork belly at Costco yet they've got the lamb shanks the roast beef I think that is no that's roast lamb for $15.99 a kilo the lamb shank I think was $17.99 you guys are gonna have to pause the video to have a look at the pricing um oh there's a, an Australian YouTuber that I really enjoy watching her channel is called our small footprint and she buys a lot of her pork here at Costco because she buys it in bulk they live off grid and she has a pretty large family and she pretty much cooks from scratch really love her channel if you go check her out just let her know in the comments that I sent you there now this is the chicken section at um, Costco they sell chicken thighs with the skin on as you guys can see there chicken wings the thing with the chicken wings is I've purchased them before and when I got home they were off so I'm a little bit hesitant to get chicken wings again but everything else at Costco is pretty good. The beef mince, I think a lot of people buy this. It's $9.99 a kilo, so obviously that's a lot cheaper than Coles and Woolies. They also have this um, beef pack that's $30. 
and oh this is a steak section which I really like they've got the wagyu's here they've got um scotch fillets and sirloins all types of goodies the pricing does range depending on what cut you're getting and what type of meat obviously and it probably is a little bit it's sorry it's not a little bit it is on the pricey end but their steak is very very good for example the one that i purchased was 130 dollars a kilo but it's really tasty guys i've purchased it before um because i don't go to costco every single week it's a bit of a treat for me so this is fifty dollars a kilo but obviously you're buying in bulk because that piece alone probably was two or three kilos it's quite heavy but if you have a big family you'll probably save lots at costco actually let me take that back not everything at costco is cheap but the quality of meat at Costco I think is quite good but I wouldn't say it's cheaper than Coles and Woolies aside from like your beef mints. The eggs at Costco I think are a lot cheaper than Coles and Woolies because the 30 pack is like it ranges from 10 to 13 dollars I believe. Milk three liters is four dollars 19. You've got your yakuts and your juices Orange juice at Costco is really tasty, $7.99 for 4 litres. So they also have A2 milk, guys. I think that's a lactose intolerant milk. I think that's 3 litres for $9.49. I'm not sure if that's cheap because I don't normally buy it. But they also sell a whole carton of Oatly milk for those who are interested. The piggies for pets, dental sticks for pets um they even sell dry food wet food all sorts of things for dogs they've got cat food costco pretty much has everything in here they even have clothing electronics they sell jewelry tvs phones um computers all sorts of electronics they've got coles and woolies brand dog food as well so they just sell it in bulk obviously like your normal pedigree and optimum dog food which i'll probably take you to to see which is here here it is the optimum dog food i don't normally buy optimum so i'm not sure how much it is at coles the vault i think some of you some of you guys have asked me about that vault i got it from costco and the clothing they also sell at Costco. I don't think the clothing is too cheap though. Um, but the option is there for those who are interested. But thanks for watching guys.